no, no. Hi gems and welcome back to my channel. Today, it is a sad day. Yes, it is. Why? Why you may ask? Because we're done with Anne with a knee after this. Like forever, like forever, forever, ever. I don't want to think about it. But yeah, today I'm reacting to episode nine and 10 of season three of Anne with an E and that's it. It's over after this. I just want to say to every single one of you who have been watching with me for the past few months, because it's taken us a, a little bit to get through this. Thank you. Thank you for all your support. Thank you for going on this journey with me. Thank you to everyone who recommended this show a few months back. I've had the time of my life. I absolutely love this show. I love all the characters. Mine is Billy. And yeah. <laughs> So thank you everyone. Uh, if you so happen to be here without having watched the rest of the season, go check that out before you even try to watch this, okay? Yeah, anywho, before we get started, if you don't know, I do have a Patreon where I post my full uncut reaction to all of my end with an E video, so make sure to check it out. It's only $5 a month if you are interested in the link in my description. But before we continue to today's reaction, let's take a pause and thank today's sponsor, Yes Soul. So today I wanna talk to you guys a little bit Bit about their bike called Yes Soul G1M Plus. And you might be wondering, girl, what? Why are we talking about a bike? If y'all don't know, I'm trying to get into my healthy girl journey over here. Like I've been going to the gym, trying to eat healthy. But one thing that I definitely have been doing more of is just doing more cardio and things that are more fun than just like lifting weights. And that is why I absolutely love this bike. I've taken cycling classes in the past. So when I saw that Yes Soul had this specific bike I was sold my favorite thing about this bike specifically is the huge screen it's a 21.5 inch screen that you can stream your favorite TV shows YouTube anything while you're working out so as you can see here I'm watching my own YouTube video yes I am because what other motivation than watching myself you know so yeah with this bike you get free and unlimited streaming so you just connect your phone and it screen shares anything that you're watching on your phone onto the screen the bike also comes with six W dual speakers so you can hear everything while you're working out. And trust me, it gets fairly loud. So the great thing about it is that even though you're watching a show or YouTube, you can still see your metrics up at the left. You can see your distance, your time, calories, and canvas. So that's great. So you can still kind of keep track of your workout while still enjoying it. My other favorite thing about this bike besides the screen is that it's so quiet. Like you can barely hear it while you're working out. So if you've been to cycling classes, you also know that some of those seats are uncomfortable not this one the thing about this seat is that it's vented so airflow kind of goes through it so you don't feel like all muggy and nasty because you're gonna sweat trust me this shape of the seat and also the extra padding added to it makes sure that it's extra comfortable for those long hard workouts because if you're anything like me sometimes I'm in that thing for like 30 minutes to an hour so you definitely need a comfy seat so if you want to be like me and get your gym grind on but not want to go to the gym get into Yesel since Black Friday is around Around the corner is peeking through you know I had to come through and give you guys a little discount code if you go to their website and use my code justly cruise you get a hundred dollars off your purchase so get into it use my code check out the link in my description for more information and thank you again yes so for sponsoring today's video let's get into the reaction right Kakwet is back Thank God, but now is she gonna have to deal with the trauma of going through that damn residential school? I hope we get a little bit of her story. Say it. Look how quick I am. Yeah, she definitely Stop learned. Good. Stop behaving like a stupid Indian. Oh no, girl. She definitely it. learned some bad habits while she was in there. You are not a stupid Indian, okay? God, that's so sad. They told me I'm worthless. That, uh, trauma, bro. I feel so bad for her because listen, she's a young child. The amount of trauma she endured from that, like, it makes sense why she's like this. That's so sad. This whole Gilbert situation is having her acting up. But he, why would he ask me? Oh, so late. <laughs> Sudden, yeah, did. girl, you better go and tell him your feelings before he goes and proposes to that girl. I love him. Oh, T girl. Wonderful girl. He likes you too. Please. So you don't know. 
Not for certain. Yeah, you won't know unless you shoot your shot. Go shoot your shot. Do not make the same mistake. I exactly. Did. Please. With another freaking Blythe at, of all things. Like, you have to tell him. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Marilla. Oh, my God. Guys, I don't think it has hit me that this will be the end of their story. Like, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Oh no, you know the amount of stuff we could have gotten from this show if we got in probably like one or more season maybe? I feel like, ugh, oh, the what ifs, the what ifs. I don't know why I'm nervous, but I am. Wait, why is he here? Yeah, it's Gilbert, why is he here? Diana's like, what is happening? I would be on the side like this. Speak with him? I I'm sorry, he went out. Well, could you tell him that's silly, I should tell him. Yeah, don't... Yeah, you tell him. Basha's mom is still not used to this life. She's not used to this. She is not. But hey, girl, like, you'll get, you'll get it. You'll get the hang. I promise. Anymore. Oh, my God. You guys. You guys. Hello. I can't do this. Ah! <laughs> Wait, like, literally? Literally? I cannot do this. Physically, mentally, emotionally... I'm just so sad we won't be able to see her in college. No, don't do that. He's not gonna see it, girl. I am without reservation. <laughs> uh, Diana, Beyond you're me, bitch. <laughs> because that would be me. I'd be like, huh? Good luck, son. Diana, you heard what you heard. Yeah, you can't. This can't happen. Oh, God. Oh God, what are these people doing here? Don't tell me they found out that she left the residential school and they're coming to get her. Cause I will actually flip my shit, I'm not joking. No, no, I, I like, I know this is part of history, but you know how f***ed up it is that this is part of history? Like it gets me mad thinking about it, bro. Like why can't we just all live together in harmony? I feel like these are the people from the residential school. Why are you bringing a gun? I'm here to collect Hannah. That's not her name. And what are you collecting? You ain't collecting shit. She don't belong to you. Lots of kids here. It's like a nest. We should grab more. You ain't grabbing shit. Why are you grabbing people's children? Dude, this is so messed up. This is messed up. Ah! No! no, 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 no. What the fuck? Love. Hmm. Well, if that is love, you must think I never loved you at all. Uh, actually, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know you said it jokingly, but yeah. And when I came to see you with Gilbert, what you wanted me to do? Granted, Marianne, this is how she's grown up. This is unfortunately the way that she's had to be. But you know, now it's time to change. But it's gonna be hard. People don't change overnight. I have a feeling that this was gonna happen, but they never like fleshed it out because the season ended. But I feel like this is what they're trying to do here. I don't know. I'm just saying. I'm not meant to have one of these, I think. Why? Oh, Miss Stacy. Even under the guidance of Rachel. I mean, they're both going through the same I'm idea where, like, they found their one true love and they could never find anybody to cover that. Fortunate in that. To have part of her with you still. Yeah, she wishes she had any parts of her husband. Now all she has is his stuff. Dozens of chances with multiple children. Oh, she would be such a good mom, I mean, though. Oh, my God. Oh, they're rebuilding the school? Lovely, yay! Oh, stop, because that sign actually made me cry. Anyone else? <laughs> I know what you meant, Moody. You've chosen a wife, haven't you? Have you, though? Like yeah, have you really chosen one, though? <laughs> a few myself. Small town girls aren't up to snuff. Billy, nobody's to talking to you, bro. Nobody. Get out of my face. Indians? Oh my word! Okay. Marilla. They're clearly here for a reason. They're not gonna kill you, babes. They took her quite. Hell. Stole her. Yeah, they literally I stole can't. her from y'all. She escaped. Came. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Somebody, you, you guys need to help him. And Morella, get over yourself, please. They're human beings, as much as you are as well. I don't understand. You must go. Son, did you guy decide you want? It's not school, baby girl. It's torture, what they're doing. I know where it is. Surely we can reason this through. No. Girl, ain't no reasoning with them white folks. Mm-mm. Matthew, a word, please. Marilla, shut up! Babe, I love you so much, but please. 
Why are these people done to you? Nothing. It's not our problem. Against oh, so if it somebody gets hurt right in front of you, it's not your problem? Interesting. If you hadn't fraternized with Kakwa is my friend. Girl, don't blame it on her. That's messed up. Yeah, literally. Just as much as your child is her whole world. Oh my god, this is so fucking sad. No, literally. How can you live without your child? They stole her from you. I believe I understand. Yeah, yeah. You don't need to. The language doesn't matter when it comes to your children. You know what I mean? Like, she got it as a mom. Oh, God, I'm scared for this because they're not getting Kakwet back. The thing about it is that, from my understanding, these children never got out, right? They never got out of there. And if they made it out alive, were they adopted into white families? Can somebody let me know if I'm correct? Like, what happened after the fact? The damn freaking letter. Ay, Dios! This, this is gonna piss me off. Good teacher, the family friend. Oh my god. Oh my god. This damn letter is never gonna get to Gilbert. She'll return in two days. Oh no. Oh, poor Marilla. Oh my god. Marilla, Marilla. Oh my god, you guys. I need episode 10 to bring everything together because if we end this in some type of like open plot, like I will get mad <laughs> and I will do what I did with Julie and the Phantoms and pretend it didn't happen. Oh, dude, Gilbert, stop mother effing playing with me. You do not want to marry Winifred. Okay, look at you. You look how happy you are when you think of Anne. Please be for real. He's going to like all of Anne's little spots. Like stop playing with me please you know your heart you know in your heart who you want god i hope he finds this damn letter now be for real right now gilbert <laughs> pick up the damn letter please oh god where did it go see this show does a great job at pissing me off what do you mean i hope it's true god i want to cry but like no I'm not gonna cry because she's coming back, right? Right? We can have hope, but I don't think so. Oh my God, I'm so scared. Like y'all don't even know right now. I'm scared. Oh God, they're, oh my God, they're speaking to them? No, they barely wanted to talk to Anne and she is a white woman. I can't even imagine what they're gonna do to them. Matthew, it's your turn. It's your turn to speak. That would not be possible. But why though? This has to be illegal. Ain't no way this is legal, bro. Like, how did this, how? How is this legal? What the f Put that shit away, what's wrong with you? You watch yourself now. Oh my God, I'm- Or what, old man? Oh my God. My face. Hand over. Wow, dude, what is happening? Just your full face or I'll shut it for you. Leave her be. Hey, 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 don't touch Matthew, bro. <laughs> What's going on? This is so fucked up. Please. He brought money. He is literally trying to buy his child back. This is Please. up. Let me explain. W what is there to explain, sister? So. Please. No, he's not. Wasn't Come he in there? At a later date and take the matter up with him. You're a fucking liar, sister. Didn't they say that in the Bible not to lie? You're a liar. Sinner! Call her out, sinner! <laughs> because what the fuck is going on? He was in there. I saw him. There's a misunderstanding. No, the it's not. So too. No, why do y'all believe oh, them? So. No, don't let him stay. Don't let him stay. No, I don't want to start crying for real, bro. I don't want to cry. Like, the tears are literally building up in my eyes. I'm not letting them fall. Because <sighs> what makes me more angry about this is that this is true. This is not something that they wrote for the sake of the story. This happened. This happened. This is so messed up. Like, it's for what? For what? To a newspaper. Oh, she's going to talk about it? will change everything. Uh, we can hope. How did residential schools even become a thing? How did this happen? Why do they think this was a good idea? And was it legal? If anybody could let me know. I'm so scared! Is this the police? Did they call the police? He was here the whole time, I told y'all! The government has decreed it's best for your kind to assimilate. <laughs> so God willing, we will kill the Indian, but save the child. 
Oh, nice. How do you call yourself a Catholic, I guess? And do that. You'll do as I say. So this is clearly legal? How? How did the government look at this and say, mm-hmm, correct, yes, you better work, bitch, yeah, we're gonna let you do that. It just baffles me. This is baffling. Oh my God. I hate it here. <laughs> no, see, <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm, I can't. I, I really try to, like, I'm trying to keep it together. I'm really trying to keep it together. <laughs> yes, you will prevail. You guys are so much stronger than this bullshit. Just why? Why can we just all love each other and let people f live their lives and have their culture and just let these people be? Well, Marilla, I'm glad you got your baby back. But there's hundreds and hundreds of native people who never got to see their babies ever again. And they'll be reunited soon. Nope, they're never gonna see her again. No. That's the f I part. I guess love doesn't conquer. Oh all. no, she's gonna think that he read it and doesn't care. Girl, he never got the no. Oh god, no. This is not how we're ending this fucking season. You don't need I'm supposed to wait outside for that so point. No. Until he, he didn't even see it, y'all. I was small, but I remember how you two argued. And then he was just gone. Yeah, where is his dad? Hey, at least he feels comfortable enough to speak like this to his mom. But I also feel like she should also tell her side of the story to him without pettiness, without anything, so he can also understand where she's coming from. A house, land, a business. This is also really sad that these people just couldn't be left alone. They hanged him? Damn. Why didn't you tell me? You are my one yeah. son. She's not gonna oh, tell you that. Left. Yeah. Again, I can understand where she's coming from. There's so much shit that happened in her life. But I feel like this is also what she needed to do. One way or the other, he was gonna have to find out. And she needs to tell him her hardships and what she gone, what she has gone through. Like your heart beating outside your chest for anyone to harm. She's just trying to protect them. Even if your child will never forgive you. Wow. Wow. I did the best I knew how. She's not perfect, man. So now it's time to kind of come together and understand one another. Because she also needs to understand where Bash is coming from as well, as much as he needs to understand where she came from as well. Look at them. They're going to stay here so they can get their baby back. Wow, and she can see them. That must be, br that would break my heart. Are you kidding me? Like you see your parents there? That was one of the hardest episodes I think this show has ever made. Holy shit. What, well done. This was beautifully done. Um, But did it break my heart? It definitely did. Uh, the whole story about the natives, just again, it breaks my heart in two because it's not fiction. This happened in real life and more people should know about it. It's extremely heartbreaking that this happened. And yeah, like it, it honestly, it breaks my heart. Like it really does. Like, I don't understand why we can't just live in harmony, bitch. But you know, that's too much to ask. That's too much to ask. Um, and then just quickly about the whole stuff with Bash and his mother, like his mom has gone through some shit, bro. Like that woman being a black woman who was, I believe, and please tell me if I'm wrong, once enslaved, if not, like it was right after uh, slavery, became illegal in Trinidad, right? If I remember from season two or something when they visited her. Um, so all she knew was to be quote unquote, how bad I said, nice to white people only because if not, if you're too ambitious, if you're too anything, to be honest, as a black person, this is what happens, what happened to her husband. So I can understand why she's so hard headed and she's the way she is and she was the way she was to her son. But on Sebastian's end, like I also get why he, grew up strong in spite of her because to him he didn't know all of this he only knew what he knew so he's like i do not want to become my mother and now bringing her here and her seeing how you know they can coexist together white people and black people as one at least in this part of town in avonlea she doesn't know how to act she doesn't understand because she's never dealt with this this was never her thing so she's trying to protect her son from what happened to her husband hopefully times have changed a little bit at least where they're from so i think they just i'm kind of glad they spoke it's hard it's hard it's some hard shit to go through but i'm glad that they spoke and hopefully they can kind of like come together and come to an understanding and live a happy life as much of a happy life a black person can have at this time to be honest because you know there's still a lot of hardships but yeah, 
Okay, let's get into the last episode and let's hope I don't sob my eyes out again, okay? Let's go. Since you've been so irrepressibly cavalier with my heart, did I he, feel like did he just break up with her? Intended to marry me. Oh, this is all as confusing. Oh my God, he's breaking up with her. And did she beg you, weeping? I'm oh so sorry. my God, is she actually like genuinely like them? That's wild. Honestly, good for him though for coming in here and just like stating the truth that he doesn't want to marry her. Talk with my father the other night, and I can see why she thought like um it was like. He gave her hope a little bit. Yeah. I feel bad for her, yeah, because she genuinely thought he was going to marry her. You can only know something when you know Yeah, it's it. kind of messed up. I feel bad for her because she genuinely thought she liked, uh, he liked her. Wouldn't it have been worse if I discovered this a week from now? True. He's saving you the heartache. It's going to hurt right now, but it's better than later. But anything less than a loving partner whose heart and gaze... Yeah, you're amazing, Winifred. You deserve somebody who matches that. And it might have been Gilbert, but he doesn't feel the same. So I think it's better for you that he didn't, quote unquote, settle for you. Will you promise? I promise. Does that mean he's not going to tell Anne for the next two mother effing weeks? You better not. <laughs> I know you just kept a promise, but you better tell my girl. Oh my God. Diana, Yay! Wow, smarty pants. Anything else you'd like to say? Want to say? Damn, Anne, you're forward, sister. I kind of like it. He's not gonna. Say, he's not gonna say anything to her because he thinks she doesn't like him. Class dismissed. You've been the best teacher in the state. Oh, Miss Stacy, you're literally godsend. Not a word to me about my note or about anything. He didn't read the note. Oh, God. Being in the middle of this, like knowing both sides, like Jesus Christ. <laughs> Kindred spirits walking arm in arm towards their. Destiny. I hope they go to Queens together so and become roommates. Again, they would see only the error of their ways. Oh, I hope they let her go. Jesus, if they don't, I'll be so mad. They love you. They won't deny you the one thing you I hope want. not. Her mom is annoying as shit with this damn Paris thing. If I'd had a son, things would be different, but we did Are y'all for real? It then follows without question that you are obliged to marry- And who the f*** are you? Oh my god, you guys are acting like her life is going to end? Because she wants to go to college? Just her whole f like to have a husband. Look what you're doing to your mother. Wow, you guys are pieces of shit. What? You have one job. And what is that? One task. In Mary? Life and you Become a wife? Y'all are. Psh, ha, ha. I don't know what to say. You're replacing. You're not me? being replaced, babe. That makes sense. Thank God, a jury. Wait, what's going on? You're not being replaced. Getting a boy after all. Oh no! Stop. That's not what that is. They will be ready to harvest in a few days' time. You're doing so well. He is. Look at him being a farmer. I don't want to show the end. Why must I watch canceled shows? Like, it makes me sad. Oh, Bash. Wait, I need to get my emotions together because, like, just seeing that little bit almost made me start crying. You are the fond object of my affection and my desire. Shut the f up. You I'm gonna leave. Are you kidding me? Imagine someone saying that to you. I'm not engaged, nor will I be, unless. Unless. It's to you, and. Oh. And with an E. My, my. No, bro, get the f out of my face, Gilbert. Are you kidding me? The man that you are, Gilbert. The man that you are. Do you need any help with the milkers? No. Why is he acting like this? We won't need as much milk when you're gone. But, but Why? Didn't even have a chance to say goodbye. Why is he acting like this? Matthew, what's going on? This is so unlike him. What's happening? God, what is going on? A lot of changes. A lot of changes. Ooh, 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 the letter. Oh my God, this is gonna make her, I don't know if this is gonna make her scream in joy or scream from like disappointment. <laughs> because she's like, wait, what? Really, Gilbert. Read it, sister. World class! <laughs> and are you serious? And this is why we don't act on emotion. I hate the show sometimes. God, why do you do this? Why? Why? Forever. Girl, you're just getting pieces of the puzzle. I can't fly. Oh, I feel really bad for her. Answer this me. is so messed up. You don't matter. No, literally, that's what her parents just said. You don't matter as a person. They've clipped your wings. Literally. They said, you're going to marry, and that's it. You're going to be the perfect wife. I want to be happy. 
I just can't be. Yeah, there's a lot that's going on right now. I wouldn't be happy either. That's for sure and certain. He's already busy living without me. I think Matthew just doesn't want her to leave. So in his way to cope with that, he's just kind of like, oh, well, she's not going to be here anymore. Back to the way they used to be. Yeah, change is hard, dude. Growing up is difficult. It sucks. It's a lot. Bash? What? Oh my god. The pain I caused both of you. I don't want or need. E no, your for apology. real. What made you want to come here? I'd like to be a part of Delphine's life. Huh. You have to prove yourself because he's not going to let you come here. Please forgive me, mama. It just sucks that this all had to happen after his mother died. But you know, people can change. I, I believe him, but again, what makes him think that he has the right to also be forgiven by these people, you know? And I was sore afraid of the change. I'm actually kind of glad that Marilla is speaking to Diana's mom. Maybe it'll get through her fucking head. I ran the risk of losing her altogether. Yeah. She's gonna end up hating you if you don't let her spread her wings. She thinks you don't care. It's his Matthew. way of coping, but like, <laughs> seriously, she honestly you thinks you don't care. He doesn't want to see her go. No. Don't <laughs> cry! Oh my god! Stop! And oh my god. Oh my god. As heavy as oh you my god. Can you, can you guys stop? She wants you to miss her, don't you see? Again, it's his way worry about us. of coping. But like, you need to tell her how you feel. He wants her to be her own person, not worry, but it's like she thinks you don't miss her. You're not gonna miss her. Like, it's sad, man. Just tell her how you feel. Otherwise, you'll lose her twice. Look, Marilla, now you're being the voice of reason. Thank you. Oh my God, I'm so happy they have each other. Holy shit, I love this family. I'm gonna miss them so much. What am I supposed to do with my life? Oh my God. Why do I wanna like sob right now? Like, oh my God, don't look at me. Don't look at me. <laughs> Stop, why are you looking at me right now? I'm not crying, you are. The <laughs> oh my god, she's like a grown-up now. What's going on? I should have brought tissues because like I didn't think I was gonna cry this much. Oh my god, they look so grown! Stop playing with me! They look like grown-ups! And I'm glad they all have each other though. That's so exciting. Oh, they may look like grown-ups, but they're still children. Like, oh, it's just, it's sad that they have to grow up so fast, but you know. It is all I for Anne. For I'm Anne? Scotland. <gasps> oh, oh my God, the Scot the Scottish people. I promise I'll do you proud. Oh, what? You and I Why is it so sad? I hate this, I hate this because it's so emotional. Guys, I have more to film after this. I'm gonna have to redo my makeup because like I'm trying really hard. You'll need to get to know your sister and help raise her with love. Oh my God. Yes, oh my God. I love this for Elijah. Honestly, I'm glad they gave him a character arc. I'm glad they made him sober and that he's changed. I love this for him. This is what you deserve, Elijah. It's just sad that it had to happen after Mary died because she had so much love for him. Oh, it's gonna make me cry again. <laughs> I was just placing flowers in your guest room. Oh my she god, she's so beautiful. Marilla made it? Oh, Marilla, that's beautiful, babe. I can't wait to open the letter. This is so exciting. I hope it's good news. I this hope it's good news. Moment. I hope it's good news. Please let it be good news. I cannot cry anymore. There's no extended family, and after my parents immigrated to Canada, there was no communication. That's so sad. <laughs> Yeah, of course it hurts, babe. Are you kidding me? She held it together for them. But, you know, there's nothing you can do. It's actually very sad that she doesn't know her lineage. And there's nothing. But now it starts with you, Anne. Think about it like this. I'm sorry. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'll miss you. Anne, you have such a beautiful family. This is, oh, my God. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. I'm gonna punch something because like why do you guys do this to me with Matthew specifically because y'all know I love this man and it's just like uh, uh, I'm upset. I'm upset. Bye. Bye. Bye now. Oh look at her. She looks so big. If I know you, you'd better tell me who. <laughs> I'm crying. We're here to speak with you about 
the orphan girl you took Listen, years ago. Listen, her memory's not that good, so let's see if she even knows anything. I'm much in there now. I don't bother. Wait, there's, there's Wait, things in it. It's locked. Keys long lost. Girl, break it at this point. I don't give a <laughs> She needs to know what's in there. Oh my God, please tell me there's like at I least like a, like a letter or something from her parents. Like, God. Hello. That fancy scene. This, okay, so Anne here. thinks... Gilbert is engaged to her. <laughs> and Winifred knows that Gilbert likes her. Hope you and Gilbert have a wonderful life together. <laughs> Girl, Winifred, read the room. She doesn't know, please. Gilbert didn't tell you anything? Tell me what? Girl, please. <laughs> please, Winifred, be the one to tell her. Been smitten with Anne ever since she first came to Avonlea and yep. smashed her slate over your head. Yep, that's the day he fell in love. Turns out you were secretly courting a mystery debutante. Ooh. Who you had the time Call him out! Call him out! The letter Anne wrote to you, even though she told you she loved you. Oh! What letter? He didn't see it! Oh my what god. Letter? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. How many minutes do I have left? Five? Mitch? No! What do you mean? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so happy they let this happen before this series got freaking canceled. My God, thank you. What are you doing? Wait, I don't think I'm ready for this. <laughs> oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God. That did not just happen. Why, why did this end? Oh my God, I can't do, I can't do this. They're so cute. I mean, it took long enough. Be your roommate, so you're coming to Queens after yes? all. Yes. <laughs> Wait, yes. <gasps> Yay! Oh. Wait, what made them change their mind? Was it Marilla talking to them? Wait a minute. This is so exciting. Ah! Stop! Get out of my face! Get out of my face! No, like y'all need to leave. <laughs> oh my God! My mother was a teacher. Wow, she was? That's amazing. This is where you get it from, your mom. Her handwriting looks like mine. <laughs> I'm so happy they got this for her. <gasps> That's what she looked like. <gasps> oh my God, Anne. Anne, I'm literally gonna cry for you. You are a wish come true. I never knew I was making. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Shut up, everyone. I can't do this anymore. I'm tired. I'm tired of crying on the internet, y'all. This show really did it. This show real... They, they did it. Yup, yeah, yup. Yeah. I look like my mother. Yes, you do, and you're beautiful. Don't y'all end it right there. Don't y'all end it right there. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna sob real tears now? Just give me a second. I'm gonna do this outro, but I actually really do. I need a second. Wait. A few minutes later. Okay. I think I'm fine now. Wow. <laughs> that was one of the most beautifully made. I'm still crying. Why are there tears still falling? I thought I was done. Okay. No, seriously. That was one of the most beautiful shows I've ever seen in my life. This has taken the top spot of shows we've watched on this channel but shows i've seen in my lifetime nothing will ever come close to the show i'm sorry like wow this was so beautifully written the stories were so fleshed out like to be honest there's nothing bad i can say about the show besides it's stressing me the hell out like that was so beautiful it's sad that we didn't get at least one more season i feel like with one more season we could we could have gotten so much more of like Anne and Gilbert's future and like, you know, things like that and everything else that has happened in the show. But honestly, I'm glad that at least we got this ending. It's unfortunate that they canceled the show, but they made the last episode so fleshed out that if somebody didn't tell me that the show got canceled, I honestly would have believed this was made and meant to be the last episode ever made of this show. I'm so happy for Anne that she got to know what her mother looked like at least and got a little piece of that. It's just, it's so beautiful. Now to cry about this for the next few weeks because what do you mean I'm done with the show? 
like I will never see the show ever again like it's so sad but that's what happens this is that's the problem with watching shows all the time is that like you just have to deal with the idea that you're never gonna see this ever again but it's fine everything's fine how are you guys doing I hope you didn't cry as much as I did because wow embarrassing but you know anywho that was it everyone that was in with an e I hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to leave a like down below and also make sure to subscribe to one become part of the gems but to continue with more shows we're watching something new next time so i hope you guys stick around hint hint is marvel themed so if you know you know but yeah so we're starting a new series that one should be fairly quickly but yeah i don't have anything else to say i've cried enough i've said enough i've felt enough i think in these last two episodes i have felt more than i have felt in the entire three seasons of this damn show and that's saying a lot because i have cried so much watching this damn show but all right enough yapping i love you guys so much thank you thank you thank you for supporting this series and for watching this with me this will forever hold a special place in my heart just like how it does with many of you but okay i'm gonna go now i love y'all please make sure to take care of yourselves and i will see you on my next video bye This is ridiculous. It's over, isn't it? Isn't it?